The final balance changes for August 2024 have finally come out. Here's an overview if you guys want to take a look, but we're going to get right into this. So first we have an arrows nerf, tower damage minus 16%, going from 111 hit points to 93 hit points. Now this isn't a bad nerf just because it will keep the interactions like killing firecracker and archers and all that, so I think this is pretty good. Evil of Goblin Drill nerf, spawned units from second spawn minus 50%, going from two goblins to one goblin. So if you guys don't know, during its second submerge, it actually spawns two goblins instead of one goblin compared to the first submerge, but they're actually removing that now because it is pretty overpowered, I guess they've been seeing. So next we are going to Evo Wizard rework, shield HP minus 36%, going from 296 hit points to 190 hit points. So this is a 106 hit points difference, but you got to keep in mind that the shield can still tank hits from say a prince, a P.E.K.K.A. So the shield will still definitely be viable, but it will be a lot weaker against spells and stuff like that. But the HP plus 5% going from 720 hit points to 754 hit points. Now this is pretty good because it does buff normal wizard as well as you guys can see down here. So I feel like it is decent having this rework because even though the shield goes down, the normal HP and the wizard goes up. So when you use your normal wizard, it will help out. Candy card buff hit speed plus 11% going from 1 hits a second to 1.11 hits a second. This is basically saying every 0.89 seconds, you will get a hit in with a cannon cart if you want a different definition of it. So next we have E-Wizard buff, spawn radius plus 20%, going from 2.5 tiles to 3 tiles. Now this buff isn't exactly needed in my eyes, but it will definitely help out the pick rate of the card, and it does help kill with graveyard and stuff like that faster, so definitely will help out. Goblin machine buff, rocket hit speed plus 14%, going from 0.25 hits a second to 0.28 hits a second. So this isn't exactly a bad buff, but... I think the card may not come back in general just because they nerfed it to the ground. It's not that good of a card anymore. Hunter buffed HP plus 5% going from 838 hit points to 884. I could be wrong, but I think the buff was plus 4% before, but they might have changed it. I'm not too sure. I could just be dumb, but that is a decent buff as the hunter does feel pretty like squishy, but he does do good damage output. So there's not much of a reason to buff his damage. Ice wizard buff splash radius plus 50% going from one tiles to 1.5 tiles. Now this buff is really really going to help out the card because if you use normal wizard and you use ice wizard then you've probably noticed there is a radius difference in how far the wizard could like hit one card and then it just travels to another card and still does damage compared to ice wizard you literally need to like tornado everything together to freeze everything so it's a little harder but this will definitely help out the card void rework damage minus 13 percent going from 544 hit points to 472 hit points and this is only if there is one troop in the area. So they are just nerfing like the one troop hits hit points. So I think that's being nerfed by like almost 200 in total out of all three. And then damage plus 58% when there's five or more troops in the area. So this will help out with skeleton army, minion gang or minion horde when I was saying goblin gang and all that stuff. So that's actually not going to be a terrible rework. Then we do have a skeleton dragons bug fix HP minus 1%. This is the most random thing ever. 563 hit points to 560 hit points i'd imagine they just did this because there was a card interaction where the skeleton dragons lived by that little sliver of health so they just wanted to change it but i don't know maybe i'm wrong but i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please sub and like if you did enjoy maybe check out my other videos too you know uh, it would be appreciated but anyways i hope you guys enjoyed and have a great day you guys